Stakeholders, international partners, local media, and interested individuals involved in the space of juvenile justice service were all in attendance this morning for the launch at the Gateway Hotel. To launch the juvenile for teenagers between the ages of 10 to 18 who come in conflict with the law, they must be provided an environment that encourages them to change for the better. Acting Governor General and Chief Justice Segib Salika, who was one of the guest speakers, spoke about his encounter involving a teenager. A 14-year-old child pleaded uh, guilty to a very serious crime, very serious offense. And I inquired as to where I should send that young, young boy. He was schooling somewhere at a school at Kilakila uh, or somewhere around there. I inquired where, where I should send that boy to. This is just my experience of the current situation on the ground. That's the situation on the ground. He wants more emphasis to be given to juvenile centers in the country. He says these centers must be educational and rehabilitation institutions instead of corrective and disciplinary environments. Say Gibbs urged parents to be responsible of their children and encourage them. That command, that train of who is that to? Who is that to? That is to the parents. That is to me, the father and the mother of the child. Pray up a child at home, nowhere else but at home. Because that's where our first teachers are. The schools and everything else, the juvenile centers, they come later on in the piece. The launch ended with UNICEF representatives presenting 20 laptops to the juvenile justice service officers to further enhance their work in the country. Lindy Suharupa, National MTV News.